congressional district now race here with Rob Zerban against Amar Kalika. You can see the numbers there, 68% now reporting a very wide gap, of course. Rob Zerban now with 79%. We want to get the latest actually from his campaign. We're going to go live to Racine where our own Terry Sater is standing by. Terry? Well, a lot of happy faces here in Racine tonight. Joining me now is Rob Zerban, uh, a big lead right now in this Democratic primary. You took on Paul Ryan two years ago, made a strong showing, but you lost. How do you turn that around as you head into the general election in November? Well, midterms for Democrats are going to be all about the turnout, and I'm really excited about having Mary Burke on the ballot. I think she can drive the kind of turnout we need to get to see the numbers we need to win this November. A lot of people have talked about you lost by a little more than 10 percent uh, two years ago. What has changed between now and then? Well, we're going to continue to build on the great results we had in 2012. You know, it was the first time Paul Ryan had been elected with less than 55 percent of the vote. We won his hometown of Janesville. We won his home county of Rock County and his home voting ward. So we're going to continue to work hard to make sure that we get the numbers out to the polls that we can win this November. We're counting a lot on the energy and excitement of the voters and the electorate. You know, Mary Burke's up in the polls right now above Scott Walker by one point. So that's a great, that, that's really energizing to our base. All right, congratulations. Uh, it looks like you're going to move on to victory. And we earlier tonight uh, talked to Amardeep Kalika, uh, whose father was shot in the Sikh temple shootings two years ago. He decided to enter the Democratic primary. And here's what he had to say earlier tonight, moving into November. Who should run against Paul Ryan? And I think the way I've handled that is I've created a stark difference, a contrast of ideals and values that uh, people can select from. Um, and I'm not a career politician, so that's the biggest value. So that's what Amar Deep said earlier tonight. Of course, it looks like he is going to lose to Rob Zerban. And we will be covering that election more uh, as we move into tomorrow morning's newscast. Live in Racine, Terry Cedar, WISN 12 News. All right, thanks for the latest there, Terry. Meanwhile, uh, Congressman Paul Ryan has released a statement tonight saying, quote, I am grateful for the support I received today from so many voters in southern Wisconsin. It goes on to say, Wisconsinites deserve a representative who will put their interest first while addressing the many challenges we face.